Hey everybody, welcome back to San Diego Market Movers. I'm your host, Jason Yoss, and I'm here with the one and only Zarai. Zarai, how you doing? <laughs> pretty good, pretty good. So Zarai and I were talking off air about, you know, all the headlines in the news lately has been about banks and a lot of them are seem to be in trouble. And I want to know, and our audience wants to know, how is that affecting the housing market? You know, it's a very interesting market that we have right now. It's not the standard. We are in total new times, new because new technology, new life, the life after COVID, everything is changed for good. Actually, it's changed for good. Um, the government has said that they are going to guarantee your holdings all the way to $250,000. So that would be the one thing you want to keep in mind is that. If you need to split your money into three, four different banks, right. I would recommend doing that just in case. But I think it's very strong. The market, the job market that came out in the last two days shows that we're still hiring a lot of people. Um, there had been not as many people um, in laid off. You know, there are few. There, there are going to be some few. Um, that's kind of what they feds won it by raising the rate, which I, I don't get that. But anyway, um, but it's still jobs out there. And I think regardless, the best asset 10 years ago, 20 years ago, and 20 years in the future, is going to be real estate. That's always an asset that is physical, that is there, that if you cannot live in it, you can rent, that if you work on paying off, you can get money. It's the best retirement plan. You don't have to worry about the SP 500 or some crazy owner go nuts on the. No, you're the crazy owner. It's up to you to make sure that your asset is rented really good. And you know, because you work with rentals. So. Um, you're the crazy owner. That's the best statement of the week right there. <laughs> you don't have to worry about a crazy owner because you get to be the crazy owner. No, it's right. That feedback is 100%. I hear it all the time, and I can't support it enough. You know, when you own a piece of real estate, it's the best investment, the best asset you can have. So our audience needs to hear that more. You know, I say if, if you want to put $10,000 towards your retirement, pay off your home. Great advice. I really appreciate that feedback. I know our audience is too as well. Zariah, thanks for being here. Everybody else, you make sure you tune in next week. Mm -hmm.